I always wanted to do that, I'm sorry. Uh, what's up guys, this video is all about the neutral game. I got a new mic today, so I'm trying it out, see how it works. Um, a lot of people ask me about spacing and how you space properly and what footsies are and that kind of thing. Uh, footsies is really complicated and it's hard to explain, kind of simply. Um, but I wanted to talk a little bit more about the neutral game, which is kind of a part of it. So basically, the neutral game is when you're both, um, kind of, you can't really do anything. Like, you're probably in, like, this range-ish, where you're both trying to get in to get your range. Um, like, either back one, or back two. Um, so it's, it's just like a range battle, so, um, like, Devora, for example, will probably want to try and run in. And like down four or something like that. Then use a hit advantage to go in. So that's a pretty safe option. Just kind of run and cancel to get in. Uh, she can also use it defensively though. So like, like when basically when you're trying to go in on the offensive side of it, like if you decide that you want to go in, you want to do something that's kind of somewhat safe unless you want to take a huge risk. So you can run in. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Run in down four. That's pretty safe. It gives you a little bit of frame advantage. Um, but I mean, you gotta be careful if Quan wants to throw a skull or something like that. Uh, or you could run in 4 one, one Start something like that that way. Um, I mean, this is just options with two characters that I know how to play. So you'd have to kind of find out first if you have like a forward advancing string or something that can low profile attacks and has a little bit of range on it. That's the other thing that you kind of want to know. And with Quan, it would be a similar thing because you'd want to do. Uh, back two, like running and back two. It's not as safe uh, unless you throw an EX room behind it. But that's kind of like his thing. Um, you could also try and run down and run in and down three. Down three is a good low profiling move. It's only minus one on block. And uh, if you hit, it's plus 15. So then you can go into this. Um, but yeah, you have to kind of run into it. Uh, another option is kind of to jump, and that's all, obviously a generic option with all the characters, but uh, if you jump in, you have to be aware of that you might get anti-aired, and by good players, you probably will get anti-aired, unless you're reading that they're doing a move and you're jumping to catch them out of that move, then, you know, it's you might not. Um, but especially in the neutral where a very patient player is going to be waiting for you to move and do something and try and counter you. Um, so jumping really isn't the best option because you can just backdash it and then whiff punish it on the landing frames, the recovery frames on the landing. Um, or just straight up anti-air them. So, And that kind of goes into like the, um, the defensive side. So basically when you're kind of in this range where you know that your opponent is going to try and come into range, um, you can do a couple of things. Uh, you can throw out a normal or something just to try and catch them coming in. Like if you see them start to move, you can just throw out like a t for Quan, for example, standing four trance or back one trance. Um, these are both good range moves and try to keep them out of your range. Um, like if Devora, let's see if I can uh, record AI. So we'll say back and up, and then she tries to do that. See, so I kind of backdash to make the move with, and then I try and punish it. Just like that. So that's me playing defensively in the neutral. I throw her on the screen, and because I can zone her better than she can zone me, I'm just going to keep her there for a while. Uh, so things like that. Um, also, you mean ju you know jump back if you think they're gonna come in. If they have like an advancing string, your jump back should catch them and you can get their um, But basically, with like with a lot of characters, like Devora has got a really strong neutral game because she's got so much reach with her forward twos and her down fours and her forward one ones that it's uh it's kind of hard to keep keep her at bay. She's got one of the best ones, and then of course defensively, you know her down four will beat most people trying to come in. So. Um, it's really hard to whiff punish her, but that's basically what you want to do is control your space um, You know use a forward advancing string if you have one that's somewhat safe and uh, 
try and jump back with punish make them miss their move basically so that you can get the advantage and then you're on the offensive and you can do what you want stay in get your pressure or hit them out and start zoning so uh, hopefully this kind of helps you a little bit kind of figure out some options of what to do because I know like I said some of my teammates and stuff have said that they struggle with some spacing options so this is kind of like my mentality when it comes to it um, but yeah let me know in the comments if it helped you Hashtag Bonehawks and all that stuff. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.